Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to episode 3 of Destiny 2 Story. We are here in the farm, and we are going to go to space. Oh, the vault! I didn't see this! Last episode, we uh, found Hawthorne. This is the vault. This is... Oh! Oh! This is all the emotes and stuff? And emblems? What? Whoa, hold on. I thought we were going to go to space immediately, but I guess not. Okay. Emperor's Shadows. Is that what we currently have? I don't know what we have. The First Wave. Laurel Triumphant. This must be stuff brought over from my having played D Destiny Year One. Maybe? I don't know. I'll have to look it up online if you guys don't already know or have already posted in the comments because you guys are such smarty pants. Prima. That's probably for playing. That's for Triumphant. First wave. That looks really pretty. I kind of want to make that one. Okay. Um, emotes. Cheer. Point. Slow clap. Great. Just great. That was really, really great. Cower. Make it stop. Make it stop. Yawn. Laugh. Cry. Is that the grieve? Is that grieve? Yes. Absolutely. Can I preview this? That doesn't look like he is. Oh, cry. No, okay. Nope. No way. No time. No how. I maybe already have Grieva moded or equipped. Whoa, there. Please. <laughs> Thank you. I like that one. I shall take that one. What is this? Salute! Oh, this is for pre-ordering. This is a... Yeah, I will definitely need to do that because I pre-ordered it. Oh, finger guns! Oh, heck yes! Oh, heck yes! Oh, heck yes! Okay. I feel pretty good about that. <laughs> okay. Uh, that's awesome. Is there anything else in there? Collections. Nope. Vaults. Cool. So our vault of all our stuff got destroyed. Unfortunately. Let's go down here. Look at these things. Okay. That was the point. Now the dance was... There's a point. There's a wave. There's a... A dance. And a sit. Okay. How can I change what those do? Finger guns is like hands down the one I'm gonna do. So the left one. The left D pad button is what it does it. Okay? Everybody good with it? Alright, sweet. Um Let's go to space. Oh, if you tap on it it shows you where everyone is. Great. Cryptarch, Soraya, the vault. Cryptarch, okay. Let's go to Earth! Campaign. This is our first, like, official, real, like, launching into a campaign thing. Huh. Wow. Okay, cutscene? No, no cutscene? Cutscene, no cutscene? There's our ship. Okay, bye. So standard loading screens. This is like kind of the same as from Destiny 1. They have to load the world. You gotta, you gotta do something while it's loading, you know? Wow. You sure you want to do this? That shard is the reason this place is called a dead zone. We have to, Hawthorne. It's a sign. Yeah, a sign that says Dead Zone. Whoa! <laughs> all right, so we've got all we've got guns now. now. That means that we can't be respawned. We would have to start at the very beginning again if we die or anything. Find a, sh a way to the shard. Is this that? Yes. I want to explore so much. I want to like find dead ghosts and stuff. You 
no. Alas. I've been all over the EDC. Charming enough. I mean, nothing says come visit like a dark haunted forest. But non guardians aren't supposed to leave the city. Here's the thing about city rules they stop applying once you leave the city. There's a small gap in the wall. Hard to see, but it's there. Nobody goes farther than that. At least nobody who wants to come back. We're doing it. We're playing Destiny 2 right now. Alright, here we go. Let's enter the wild. I wonder what we're gonna kind of like enemies we're gonna have out here. Still don't got that double jump yet. I really like I'm trying really hard not to explore right now. I'm trying really hard to just stay focused because the adventurer in me just wants to go find all the things that are in the corners of the map. What is down there? Death. And probably some hidden things. Look at this wall of mist in front of us. Where are we going? Oh, we're going. I was like, why am I here? Why am I doing this? Let me know when you reach me. Hawthorne, can you hear us? Nolan bot sounds it's so dead. tired. Poor guy. Poor bot. You want me to switch to a power weapon? That's not a good sign. Are we going to be finding Fallen or something around here? What was that? Was that my ghost? Did you hear something? No. Not yet. Sounds like I will be, though. Ouch. Oh, it has an arrow now to demonstrate. The Fallen. Yo, you got a little cloak like me, dude! You're called a marauder. Dope. You have a cloak! You're like a hunter! Those eh. fallen weren't wearing any house colors we've seen before. Hmm. How are the fallen still like alive and kicking? Why doesn't why didn't Gaul kill all of them? I really want to know what happens to the speaker. Like, what does the speaker say? What does Gaul tell him? Quarantine sector 236. Spawning is still restricted. Who's surprised? A chest! Is this like a very special chest? Some chests will appear on the map. A loot chest. I got a new kinetic weapon. Cool. Power's up to 12 now. Did I equip it? I think I did, right? Yeah, I just didn't switch to it yet. Cool. It's a it's a auto rifle, accurate. Hawthorne forged this weapon out of scraps and salvage. Or no, you didn't. You did that for this one. <laughs> Same flavor text. Recoil pattern is more vertical. Nice. That's actually really useful, especially or in trials. It's really not trials. PVP. It's very useful. Should we go up? I think we should go up. But what is in this corner? Always check it. Literally today, literally today, I was like playing through Destiny 1 just a little bit to like say goodbye to it emotionally. The shard of the traveler. Oh, there it is. This is it. Right out of our vision. And uh, I discovered a new dead ghost in the tower. It was a dead ghost that I revived in the tower. It was in a tree. And I'd found a couple other ghosts in the in the in the city in the tower before. 
But uh, I couldn't believe it. On my very, literally my very last day of playing Destiny 1, I found a new hidden dead ghost that I'm sure like everyone else already knew about. But I had not. It's very special. And that is why I explore. Like to me, that little corner over there, I want to go to it. I won't do this again, but I'm just saying like, and what is over here? And what is down there? And what is, you know, etc. Like I'm sure I'm gonna die if I go over there, but you get the point. A curious mind I have. Wait, can I not go back now? Okay, good. <laughs> Alright, moving forward. It hurts. It hurts my bones. When I hear that, when I do that, I just want to explore. I'm not exploring. Following my guidance thing on my map. That's a fire. Why is there a fire in the woods? Is this Cabal stuff? Is this a Cabal ship? Oh, okay. Hi. Hello, folks. Were you all just like chilling? What, what, where did you come from? Are these vandal? No. Dregs? Maybe. Does he have a new symbol over one of his letters? No. Cool. Refugee. I just picked up boots? How did I just pick up boots? Like, what do you even mean? Okay, use the kinetic. The kinetic does more unless they have an element. How did I pick up boots when I was just like killing someone? Hi. And I just got something else too. Let's go into our let's drop back a little bit and go into our menu. What did I get? Level 10? Level 21. The hunter has become the hunted. Very true. Very true. Uh from 10 to 24. Keep it moving. Swift of foot and long of stride. I'm um, so cool. No, no thank you. It's interesting. It almost feels like it's an auto pulse rifle. It's technically an auto rifle, but it feels, or an auto scout rifle is actually more accurate. It shoots all of them uh, independently, but it's full auto. I don't really need to zoom in. Don't have the double jump yet. Come on. Come on. I'm still blown that like you can you can get items from just killing dudes. That's very cool. What's up, wretch? I've never seen you before. Okay, slow reload. Another pariah. So now I've supposedly, I've read that all the guns will have uh, same stuff. So supposedly this pariah will be the exact same as the other gun. In fact, the attack goes down a little bit. So yeah, all of the stats are the same. Cool. Well, we're gonna obviously keep the current one because it has a tiny bit, little bit better power. Okay, feeling good. It's really late, so I'm not like super loose and having fun. I'm like really focused, but I also take Destiny really seriously. Probably more seriously than I should. But not as seriously as other people. Hello! Hi, Dreg. Marauder. Have I seen Marauders before? Contra Call. Or besides this game. What I'm asking is if I've seen them in Destiny 1. And if I have to ask that question, the answer's probably no. But then again, I haven't played Destiny 1 for like a year before today. Hello! We're really close to getting to level 2. 
At which point, I think we'll be able to do some upgrades. Wow. We're really close. We're going in. I dropped an Ingram. He dropped an Ingram too? New objective. Did I get it yet? There it is. Refugee vest. Hi, you. So you have a thing, a shield. Let's switch to our elemental thing. I have no control over this. Let's chill for a second. That's a grenade. No thanks. There, that was the thing. That's what I'm talking about when I say to do the stuffs. Excellent. Another engram. Spider bite onesie. One SI? I told you guys how much I love this game. Whoa, there's a party over here. Okay. Let's party. I don't have a grenade. I tried to throw a grenade. I does not have one. Makor starving sca Maxer starving scavenger. Don't get too close to him. I feel like he could probably one shot us if he wanted to. He says as he goes in for a knife kill. I think we scared them away. You sound so tired. Take me to the shard. Sounds like a cutscene. Why we were led here. I haven't been as close to the traveler's light since. Do you feel it? Hold on to your helmet. Do you feel it? The light is back. We're back. Like, no joke, like, this stuff is, like, hitting me. Arc Strider Hunter Subclass Unlocked. We're back! 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 We are back! We are back. Whew. Okay, let's look at this stuff. Let's look at this. Let's look at this. Let's look at this. Arc Strider. So this is the new subclass. Well, it's like a, it's like a uh, reworked subclass. You guys saw the uh, gunslinger in the first mission. Flux grenade. Sorry, let's focus. I got the hiccups. Arc staff. So instead of shooting a golden gun, pew, 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 we now have like a little staff thing and we get covered in electricity and we like zoom around and kill everyone. It's great. Okay, form a staff of pure arc energy and acrobatically take out your foes. Yes, that's the thing. Skip grenade. Uh, splits upon impact, creating multiple projectiles. That's probably good for me right now. Uh, deals additional when it's attached and bolts of lightning to nearby enemies. Yes. So I don't have an upgrade point yet. Uh, but we're gonna what we're gonna we're gonna let's take a second to talk about this, okay? So these are the two dodges that you get as these are called your class abilities. Uh, each class um, has a different thing that they can do. So Titans can do a different thing and Warlocks can do a different thing. For hunters, they have a dodge because they're supposed to be kind of up and in there and like in people's faces, kind of or medium, whatever. So they have dodges. One of the dodges is it automatically reloads your weapon. Okay, so you can like run out of ammo dodge instant reload or you can dodge and it will recharge your melee ability so your melee you can do the normal knife thing but you also have a melee ability not just a normal knife stab melee kill attack um but like for a hunter a throwing knife so from a distance you could press the melee and it would throw a knife at some someone straight ahead so hopefully you're aiming it well enough and it hits them 
Um, so what you could do is, like, you're a hunter, you're moving in, or maybe you're waiting in, 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 in wait for someone, and you have a shotgun, and you shotgun them, and they're not quite dead. You stab them. Uh, they die or they don't die, who knows. And then you can dodge again and do another thing. The, the, the knife is just one example. There's also, I think, an increased power melee and I think also a increased distance melee. I don't know. We'll, we'll, we'll find out. But uh, it's pretty cool. So I probably will do the gambler's dodge personally. Maybe in PvE it would be this, but uh, I think probably in general I'll do the gambler's dodge instead of the marksman's dodge. But who knows? I could change. Um, greater heights. Oh, I don't have my third jump yet. Dang it. We'll get to it. Then up here in this corner, there's, there's, there's this stuff down here and there's this stuff up here. So sector one on the bottom, combination blow. I don't know if I know what this stuff is, so learn with me. Kill an enemy with this melee ability to trigger health generation and increase your melee damage temporarily. So you kill someone with melee ability and it triggers immediate health regeneration and increases your melee damage temporarily. Cool. So kill with a melee, heal, and get better heal me melee damage. So combination blow would work well with this because this is gonna activate, if you get a kill, it's gonna give you health. So let's say it was like pretty close to dying or you have other enemies around or whatever. It'll immediately regenerate health and you now have increased melee damage. And this one recharges your melee ability. Option two here, melee kills recharge your dodge ability. So you can melee and then dodge. Mele okay, melee get a kill, recharge dodge. Dodge, you get a, and then you melee again. And then your dodge recharges your melee. So then you melee and you get a kill and then you, that sounds interesting. It kind of goes back and forth, recharging each other. Dodging increases your melee range, allowing you to lunge further to strike enemies. Cool. After dodging, each arc staff hit creates a damaging lightning sh aftershock. After dodging, each hit, each arc staff creates a damaging lightning aftershock. Cool. Um, I don't know when that would be most useful of PvP or PvE. But it sounds interesting. I'll have to look into it more. Here we go. This one down here. Disorienting blow. Way of the wind. What is these? Way of the warriors. Way of the winds. Strike an enemy with this melee ability to disorient the target and nearby enemies. Strike an enemy. I guess melee? Melee strike? Melee strike an enemy. Yeah, melee strike an enemy with this melee ability. Disorient. So instead of a smoke. So previously they had a smoke that kind of blinded them. I assume it's like a like a... Boom, disorient blow, it kind of goes white or you can't see or whatever. Option two, focused breathing. Sprinting recharges your dodge ability. Increased maximum sprint speed. Hmm, interesting. Combat meditation. When critically wounded, melee and grenades recharge drastically faster. For those who like to play on the edge of death. Lightning reflexes, you are harder to kill while dodging. That sounds good. I like four and one currently. Well, this would be really useful for PvP. This, I don't know, I don't know. One and four are currently interesting to me and which are technically called disorienting blow and lightning reflexes. Maybe you get all of them or do you just get one of them? I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. Maybe you just choose whether you wanna do way of the warrior or way of the wind. I don't know, we'll find out another day. So, uh, yeah, that's kind of what that thing is right now. Let's look at the items that we got. So, let's go ahead and upgrade, equip this. You can dismantle things. I could dismantle this. I could dismantle this other stuff over here. But, uh, highly recommend on doing that until, like, I don't know. I'm, right now, like, I remember in Destiny 1, there was actually a gun that was really, really good. And it was like a green. Green is really low level. So, like, don't get rid of guns just because they're... Because you can infuse. And what is infusion? You take a higher level gun and you infuse it into a lower level. It's my super ready. Super is charged. I've been talking so long that my super is now charged. Um, and it brings that level of that lower gun up. That's nice. Okay. This is a 21. These are the same. These are not the same. A grenade launcher. My power is 18 now. I'm so 
excited. 22, 22. Okay, let's look at this stuff over here. 10, 22. Yeah, let's go ahead and equip that. Well, you've looked better. But hey, you've looked worse. Worse. 24 and 10. 21 and 10. Great. Okay, we now have light. What is this? What is this thing? Time to shop. Okay. I don't know how to do it. I really don't know what I'm doing. Did I do it? Did I do this stuff? Where'd he go? Oh, I can keep I can keep supering. Yeah? I can keep supering? I can keep supering. Now, there is like other... Uh, yep, okay, I'm trying different buttons now. Oh, this is beautiful. Okay, so there's different buttons. You can push the melee button, which for me is down on the right stick. Or you can push R2 as well. Where did that endless... Uh, give me another endless light thing, that's beautiful. Oh, I didn't. I have to activate it. Please don't die. I mean, you can die now. You have light, but please don't. All right, here we go. So cool. Okay, where? Goodness gracious! Run away. Find more endless light. Well, first, just can we heal? Uh, can we maybe just not die? Welcome to the days of being hunted by enemies. Yep. But we can be revived now, though. Cool little symbols with the dreg stuff. Is there a boundless light somewhere? There it is over there. That was an engram. No? Ammo? Must have been ammo. I'm gonna use my... Oh, hello, you. Crazy. I, there's still much I need to learn about that super. Because basically there's two buttons you can use and they do different things and you can combo them. It's like a fighting game. You can go like, let's say if it's A and B, you can do A, 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 B, 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 A, B, A, B, A, B, 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 A. Like there's a lot of different things you can do. So, for example, that's A. That's something else you can do. I leveled up! Levels increase, they upgrade new points and unlock and stuff and the things and the super cool stuff. Particularly that thing is really cool. Awesome! We are now up a level. Go into this thing. Let's do it. I don't know what we're doing, but let's do it. Choose an ability to unlock with your upgrade point. Which one? Upgrade point. But it requires level whatever. I could do... I think I have to do that one. <laughs> Clearly that's the one I have to do. These are all the other different levels. So we're going to do the Marksman's Dodge. First. Dodge and perform an evasive maneuver with a steady hand. Reloads your weapon. Binds to circle, circle. Okay. Very cool. Did we not... Didn't we get another thing? Yeah, we did. Oh. I think we're in a cutscene. Oh, maybe... Maybe we just finished that thing? We got the light. I think the important thing was to get the light and kill the dude, and we did that. So, yay. Yay. Good job, team. High five. That new ability, the new ult, is, or super as it's called, is very interesting. I think it's really good. 
I'm just not good with it yet. I tried it out in the beta a couple times. Just need more time with it. Golden Gun to me is like an old friend. I just know exactly how to do it. But yeah. How are you guys thinking of this so far? Well, this is episode Trace? Is that what episode we're on now? I think so. Making them nice and long for you. Because it's so cool. I gotta figure out my uploading schedule for this stuff if I'm gonna do one of these every single day. Cause, which would be fine with me. But if that would be okay with you guys or whatnot. And if I, you know, need to do those other games. I have some episodes of other games. But Destiny is so good. I just, I love Destiny. Can you tell? Can you tell? Guardians. <laughs> New cooperative play and crucible PvP available. All activities, including campaign, are now open for cooperative play. Use the roster to invite or join other guardians. Speak to Lord Jax to battle other guardians player versus player competition in the Crucible. Co-op co and Crucible. So campaign is now available for co-op and PvP is available as well. Got it. My, it's really late for me, so my brain is like slow on processing things right now. Cool. Look at all these people here. I'm gonna dance. Look at that hair. It's a green mohawk. Finger guns. Someone found Shadow Dance. Oh, because they... The finger guns! Shadow Dance is the finger guns. Uh, what am I supposed to do? Hold open the roster. What is it trying to get me to do? What is this? What is that? I'm level two. <laughs> view R1 to view the roster. There we go. Okay, hello. Hello, friends. Hello, friends who are online. Everyone's playing Destiny. <laughs> of course they are. Wait, one person's not. Never mind. Everyone is. Every little everyone's playing Destiny. Uh, cool. Let's hold this open. Oh, I did view the roster. I'm viewing the roster. I don't care. Okay. Uh, this thing. I have to speak to Shax and speak to Hawthorne at the farm. Cool. Shax is here? Shax! What's up, dude? It's you. You and I walked together as the tower burned. <laughs> and now, here you stand. Your light burns a path before us. And on that path, I see many battles ahead of you. Battles only you can win. The crucible of Lord Shax will prepare you. In my arena, should a titan stand in your way, crush him. If a hunter confronts you, break her blade. If a warlock speaks, feed him his words. There is only one path to victory, Guardian. See you on the battlefield. Hell yeah. Lord Shax oversees the Crucible, a tournament that trains Guardians by pitting them against one another in friendly competition. Through the future, though the future of the Crucible was in doubt after the fall of the city, Shax is convinced that it is needed now more than ever. Complete matches in the Crucible to hone your skills against other players and earn rewards. Great. Accept. What have I accepted? Milestone updated. Complete two map sh matches in the quick play playlist. Faction reward. Complete crucible matches and challenges to get crucible tokens and earn level 20 rewards from this faction. Well, we are only level two. Crucible tokens. I wonder what those are and earn level 20 rewards from this faction. Cool. Well, we are not level 20. So should we do it? Okay, thanks, man. Tell me. You don't fear Vanguard operations. Do you fear the Crucible? So it looks like at the top of the screen is a reputation bar, which will increase as we perhaps play Crucible. Oh, it's oh, it's Arkite, Arsite, Arksite. He's a weapon guy. 
you want Glimmer. I want to give you Glimmer, but not right now because I need to go give it to, what's her name? Soraya. And you have Reputation up here as well. Very cool. An engram? Contains a reward for your efforts in assisting. Oh, I can go in here and buy a weapon. Well, this stuff is real good, but I'm not ready for it. Uh-uh. I'm not ready for this. How, what? That's so crazy. Okay. Focus. Focus. I can't focus. I'm so excited. <laughs> okay, what am I supposed to do? I'm supposed to go talk to her. I am supposed to go talk to her because I, I need to buy stuff. I need to buy stuff from her. <laughs> Sell me your things, please. Look at you. You got your life back. Indeed. I don't know how you did it, but I'm glad. Because we're going to need it. This is a big there deal. There are a lot more survivors out there, and they need our help. We got to get the word out that the farm is a safe haven. I sent a friend into the EDZ a few hours ago to set up a comm network. His name's Devram K. Good guy. Great shot. Don't tell him I said that. If you give him a hand, I'd take it as a personal favor. Okay. Well, I want to do you personal favors because you're great. But, like, getting our light back. We are the, in our storyline, we are the only guardian in the world, in the universe, who has their light. We are the only one. That's amazing. Your vision from the Traveler was true, and it led you back to the light. The camp is even safer now that you have reconnected to your power. But there are still a lot of people out there in the wild who need refuge. Help get them to the farm. Go meet Hawthorne's friend Devrim by selecting the landing zone Trustland in the EDZ. Acceptando! Devrim K, we're gonna go talk to him. But first, we're gonna do, can I compare? I can compare, I need a helmet. I need a helmet, should I buy this helmet? All of these are better than what I have. But this one in particular. So, I'm gonna buy it. I think that's a good one. Thanks, me too. Also, I didn't get to finish. What was that? Uh, let's see. When you look at the stuff we picked up, this thing, equip that thing. I know, man. I need to take a shot for every power level I go up. I would die. I would die. I would be 12 shots deep right now. I would die. Someone just did something, leveled up or something. I just heard that. 21, 25. Time to embrace humbleness. Yeah, I guess so. Without light to sustain it, this body of mine cannot make the pilgrimage to the shard, but you can. Every journey, what? Yeah, I know we've seen that. Okay. To join. Cool. Keep your wits about you. That's all that you have left. Am I fast? Am I fasty fast? I'm so speedy. Why am I glow? I'm glowing. Commander's blessing. Why do I have commander's blessing? What is commander's blessing? And why does I have it? What? What is this? Did someone activate it for all of us? It's interesting, the clamber the clamber thing is interesting. Okay, I guess I'm gonna wrap it up here because we did a lot, right? We did a lot, right? Yeah, we did a lot. Okay, I'm gonna wrap it up here. Thank you guys very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this. My name is TJ. Uh, I love this. I think we should go play a game in the Crucible next and just see what it's like. I don't think it would be good at all, but I don't, th I don't think I'm gonna do well at all. But I feel like we should just try it, no? No, we shouldn't try it. I'm gonna think about it. I'll let you know. Tune in next episode to find out if we are gonna do an episode of the Crucible or not. I don't know. Okay, thanks for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed this. See you next episode. Have fun. Woo!